Good Friday morning, everybody. This is Steve Monday, Chief Forecaster for Rowan County Weather. Let's go ahead and take a look at what's going on outside currently. And as you can see, there are some showers making their way through the portions of eastern Tennessee. And there's some isolated showers and storms off to our east as well out toward the coast. These uh, showers out toward eastern Tennessee, right in behind them is where our cold front is. And you can see it uh, even more clearly when I turn on the uh, Miso fill. Let's go ahead and turn that on so you can see those color contours. So there you see 50s and 60s on the eastern side of that front, 40s and 30s back on the western side. And uh, the front will continue to make its way east into our area as we go through uh, the rest of the day. And by the afternoon, we'll start to, to dry out with any rain chances that come through. Currently, it's 63 degrees in Salisbury, low to mid 60s around the county, 60s out toward the coast and 50s and 40s up in the mountains, depending on the elevation. Let's go ahead and take and turn all this off and show you what the models are suggesting in terms of when this, uh, when the rain is going to actually be through the area. So uh, this is 7 a.m. this morning, and as we make our way through the uh, morning hours, uh, we're now at 10 a.m., and as you can see, everything's kind of sparse and sporadic for us. This is by 1 p.m., by 4 p.m., there are some isolated rain chances that come through, uh, but as we head to the evening hours, we really start to uh, dry out and cool down, and it's going to be nice and chilly by this, after, or by this evening as we make our way into the uh, evening hours. Weather impacts today, isolated rain chances this morning becoming mostly cloudy as we move through the afternoon. Winds out of the north will be gusty at times, bringing in cooler air as the cold front approaches, and we'll see mostly cloudy skies by this evening. If you're looking for things to do this weekend, Cruising the Grove presented by Nick and Donna Deal in China Grove on uh, Saturday from 2 to 6 p.m. Uh, you can head on out there. The town does encourage you to socially distance. They also advise that all cars must turn on a diagonal at 2 p.m. And they ask that you do not share or hold spots for folks. Uh, it's a good opportunity for you to go out and see some classic cars. If you're worried about being able to socially distance, they do leave one lane of Main Street open. And you could literally ride down Main Street inside of your vehicle and take a look at these cars and still be able to socially distance and uh, enjoy the event as it occurs. Uh, if cars aren't your thing and you like to go see the colors of the leaves changing in the mountains, here's the current leaf colors going on right now. You can see we've got low conditions here in the county as you start to head west into the Hickory, Yadkinville, Statesville areas. Uh, the colors are moderate. And then once you get to the higher elevations into the mountains around uh, Boone, Grassy Creek, Asheville, Waynesville, uh, those areas are, are seeing peak colors, especially up uh, along Grandfather Mountain, Water Rock Knob, places like that on the parkway. The five-day forecast sponsored by SA Sloop Heating and Cooling, built on integrity. Give them a call, 704-857-5684, or visit them at www.sasloop.com. Mention that you saw they sponsor the forecast on Rowan County weather. We'll give you $25 off your first-time service call. Uh, as far as what the five-day forecast brings for us, we'll see isolated rain chances this morning, around 40%, uh, high of 63 Increasing cloudiness to most of, mostly cloudy skies by this evening with a low of 40. On Saturday, sunny skies high of 61, low of 39 under mostly clear skies. Sunday, sunny skies with a high of 65, mostly clear Sunday evening with a low of 47. On Monday, we start to see a Bermuda high enter into the area, and that's going to warm the temperatures back up a little bit. We'll see 72 for the high on Monday with sunny skies, low of 51 under mostly clear skies. On Tuesday, we start to see some increasing cloudiness with a high of 74 under partly sunny skies, mostly cloudy skies Tuesday evening with a low of 65. To be able to keep up with what we're going or what we have going on with the weather around the county, you can visit us anytime on our website at www.rowancountyweather.com on our social media pages, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And if you know someone who does not utilize the internet or social media, but they have cable television, they can check us out on WSRG TV in Salisbury. That's available on Hotwire and Spectrum. And we'll keep you updated on the weather at all of those venues. As always, thank you for following Rowan County Weather and enjoy your Friday.